Hey Pisces and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your daily love reading for the 30th of July. Thank you so very much for joining me for your daily love reading. So let's get started right away. What messages do you have for Pisces? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right. Well, look at that. Thank God. Hallelujah. Getting out of that headspace, getting out of the fear, getting out of the sadness, the depression, the anxiety, um, and no longer feeling trapped by your situation, no longer feeling um, like you have no options is what I'm hearing. The person you are dealing with. That is some awesome energy. Wow. Could be dealing with a Scorpio. They had this card in their uh, person's position as well. So you're dealing with somebody who's very quiet. And that is why um, the, the stress was there. The anxiety. I'm not even kidding you. I used a completely different deck. And these are the same cards that came out. So the energy coming towards you. The Queen of Wands. The Knight of Wands. The Judgment. So... The person that you're dealing with has been very quiet, creating this, this energy where you're very worried because they haven't been reaching out to you. They haven't been talking to you. Why haven't they been talking to me? Um, what's Spirit's advice? While this person is just really trying to find balance in their own life, um, they are trying to figure out their next move. Um, they could be keeping secrets, but I'm not really seeing that. Uh... Not, not this person. Um, this person could have been just sitting back waiting for the right time because they knew the spiritual connection the two of you had. So they weren't worried about it. Um, the energy coming in for you, you could have a fire sign coming in very quickly because um, they are facing you. This is somebody that um, you have been with in this lifetime already. You are in separation or, or broken up. This person is very confident, very, um, very attractive. Like people are just naturally drawn to her. Um, yeah, just very, uh, like, oh, what is the word I'm looking for? Like desirable. This person's also like very vibrant, very like them being around you just automatically brings up their energy or your energy. So let's see what the swords are all about. Why the eight and nine of swords? Thank you. Yep, because the communication, because this person was silent is why you are worrying and, and stressing. Um, but you're no longer fearing that because communication could be opening up. But that is why um, you were so worried about where this connection was going. Why is the high priestess here? Thank you. Yeah, they walked away from you. They ghosted you. They left you out in the cold. Um, they just, one day they're here, the next day they're gone. It was like a magic trick. They disappeared, not to be heard from, not to be seen. Um, and they went back to a situation that they were dealing with before you or when they met you is what I'm getting. Um, the energy coming in for you, this is happening because they have figured out what they want. They're no longer at that crossroads. They're no longer stuck in their thoughts. Um, Spirit's advice is to stand your ground, to take back control of your life, to not settle for less. If this person comes in and tries to offer you like the fuck boy card, nope, I'm not taking any night. I am high vibration. Um, you are the emperor, so um, do not settle for anything less. Because this person is returning to you. And if they come back making you an offer that you don't like or that is not good enough for you, they may take off again, but they will be back. Um, to, and they won't come back until that offer is what um, what you need it to be. Why is the Three of Pentacles here in the outcome for Pisces? Ooh. There it is. Uh, you have to be connected to a Scorpio. They have all the same cards, but this is building a strong foundation. You, your person and uh, source. This is trying to work it out. Let's work this out. Let's try this again. The passion is there. The love is there. 
Um, let's give this another go. Um, it's also you working um, on your connection, your intuitive connection. You guys are very intuitive. Oh my goodness. You have to be dealing with a Scorpio. These are their two cards. Watch this, that reading, please. Um, you guys are both going to fight for this and it's going to be um, successful. Uh, your connection to source will be that much stronger. Um, like I said, this person did ghost you and walk away from you in the past, or you did this, Pisces. But they're going to come back uh, very quickly. Be careful. It's not just for sex. Um, make sure you stand your ground and be confident. Have that confidence that they will return. Don't settle for a less than what you deserve offer. Spirit's advice is to... Um, get your life back in control take back control of that your life don't settle even if it means moving away even if it means moving on for a while this person will be back they're not going to let you go but you have to um set your boundaries and you have to draw that line in the sand that you will not settle for anything less or they will come back with a um less than you deserve offer uh let's see what we all what all flew out here yeah, there was other competition in your guys' way in the past that put you in this delay because they did walk away. Um, you have been working very hard on your finances as well as uh, um, manifesting. But this person does love you unconditionally. There is a strong bond. This is the yin and yang energy. Um, and your wishes are about to come true. Your prayers have been heard and the universe is about to... Um, bring this person back into your life so be ready that stress that worry let it go they are returning that communication is opening back up for you guys so have confidence and have the faith that this is returning and it will work this time so all right pisces i hope you have a beautiful day um, make sure you join me tomorrow for your daily reading please subscribe so you don't miss any notifications of when i'm going live i will be going live a lot more now so um, I hope to you hit that subscribe button. Um, please hit the like as, as well if you, if you would. I would much appreciate it. I send you all my love, guys. God bless.